individual report awards. So what are the criteria ba? Uh, paano namin uh, nakuha? Or uh, si, paano na-compute? Or paano ba namin, saan namin binase yung pagkakaroon ng ganitong awards? So uh, we, we have the criteria of timely submission, 100%. That is based on HO monitoring. So, alam niyo naman na um, submission natin is well monitored na ng head office natin in the facility office. So, for on-time submissions, you will have 100%. Late is 80%. Non-submission is 0%. So, and there will be deductive of 1% in overall score for each lapse. Kung mara meron kayong mga reports uh, uh, issue sa accuracy ng report, sa completeness of content, and then proper documentation. These criteria are for the weekly progress report, Pareto analysis, QAQC report, President's POC, turn, turnover warranty monitoring, minutes of the meetings, issues and concerns report, daily dashboard report, and visit submission. So these are all based on your submission with just a deductive kung meron tayong mga naging access. So let's start. So are you ready na? Yes, po. Yeah. Thumbs up if you're ready to know who are the nominated and who achieve or attain our uh, awards. Ready? So thumbs up if ready. So, ready na tayo. So, let's move to the first one. First award is weekly progress report. So, this is individual. Ha? So, ito yung mga, mga employees natin na nagsisend ng ganit, ganitong report. So, weekly progress report. So, ano ba yung weekly progress report? So, ito yung nila naman dito is yung update of the project. Picture is POC and other requirements or uh, data na kailangan ni CMD in the head office. So, again, that is from January to November 2021. So, sino ba, Colleen, yung mga nag-top three natin sa weekly progress report? Nasaan ba yung ano natin? Brown natin. <laughs> Top three are... Kevin Joseph Moralitat of Amaya North Point. Second is Christopher John Guasena of Avida North Point. And Jackie Luca Alim of Amaya Scapes North Point. So be ready. The top is yes, your speech. Consistent. I'm adding um, Peter for his support. <laughs> So we have so this certificate of commendation is proudly presented as the best in weekly progress report in recognition of your extraordinary efforts and dedication in submitting your report on time and of higher accuracy. Gardening a score of 96.91% Report submission efficiency from January to November. We have Jackie Luca Alim of Can we have a short speech from Jackie? Short loud. Jackie, can we have a, uh, a short, short lang, short, short, short. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I would like to, I uh, know, thank you. Sa akon yung mga ukod. Um, kung hindi man ni... Ay, sorry, Tagalog, Alina. No? Yes! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I expect all my, ano, my teammates uh, without their, ano, without their help, uh, hindi, uh, hindi ko siya ma-achieve. Ma so, thank you, everyone. 
And thank you to all of you. Thank you. Pwede man ano, pwede man na yung ilonggo. Translate ni Aubrey. Ano ko na, sir? Pwede man ilonggo para ma... Para ma marinig nila yung yung salita mo. Salita. Ito translate ni Ano na yan sir? Halo. Ito translate ni Aubrey. Yes, ito. Aubrey. Sir, ano si Aubrey? Audrey. Ah, uh, mamiyari paano mo daw na-achieve yun para yung mga site sa susunod maging kalaban mo talaga. Oo. Oh, uh, paano mo daw na-achieve yung best weekly uh, progress report? Ah, um, ano lang naman sir, uh, time management at saka mostly naman kasi ng ano ng uh, units kasi dito is uh, ano siya um, advanced kaya uh, yung mga nasa, yung mga target uh, talagang mahihit siya before yung ano niya, yung uh, deadline, yung init oh, deadline. Na. Ano to best in oi oh, weekly progress report to. Oh. Eh, Aubrey. <laughs> Bakit? Yung 86.21 mo kasi, submission, ibig sabihin... Ay, sabi, ano yun yung gano'n? Yung kay Ma'am Nix? Uh, submission, ibig sabihin. Ano? Ibig sabihin, uh, on time ka mag-submit. Bakit ka pa on time mag-submit? Okay, okay. Ano bang ginagawa mo? Ano rin sir, time management, sir? At saka push ng push ni Ma'am Audrey, eh. Hindi uh, na ako maano kasi January to November ka. Sige. Next. So, so, best in dashboard. Oh, may may mga tanong pa. Sino pa may tanong sa ating oh, winner? Oh, may mga tanong pa kayo. <laughs> Wala na sana. Ito po, Agnes. Ito po, Jagroy. Sige, masabot. Okay. Masa yung stand natin, ma'am? Okay. Yung sa cellphone, meron kang ganun mo. Gamit mo, ma'am. Oo nga, para kita tayo lahat, ma'am. Para kita tayo lahat, ilagay ko dito. Team, okay na. Okay, off na lang yung mic nung hindi nagsasalita. No? Ay, naiirita si Ansel. Pagka may mga naka-mic, open mic. Sino ba na? Ibang, hindi, yung ibang project. Nagaan. Hindi, kayo. 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 Kayo yung project. Sir, dyan kasi. Sa inyo, sa inyong project. Yan. Kaya, okay. Okay, so next natin is for the Pareto Analysis Report. So, same lang din tayo ng criteria as I've said earlier. So, that's from January to November. So, our top three for Pareto Analysis Report. We have Audrey Marie Adra of Avita Village, Piloilo. And Joseph Torres of Amaya Escapes, North Point. And also, Christopher John Wasena of Avita Village North Point. So, ang North Point ay nakikita nyo na pa, lagi silang nanonominate. So, we have also yung Avita Village Filipino. So, for the timely submission of their reports for the Pareto Analysis Report, gardening, uh, gardening of 90.19% report submission efficiency. Winner is Joseph Torres of Amaya Escapes, North Point for the best in Pareto Analysis Report. So, Joseph, for the speech for Uh, salamat po sa mga sa salang sa nag ano po ng award na ma-recognize po yung effort ng effort namin to submit and to encourage us to submit online. Uh, this is because of the team din kasi pa rin to eh. Uh, kinukuha ko rin yung mga data sa team members. So wala, maraming salamat din sa team po sa SNP. That's all po. Thank you. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Next is for the QAQC report of the year. So, uh, emphasize lang namin that this is based on the report submission of the QAQC report. For our top three, we have Lane Lucina Baguya of Amaya Escapes Ordaneta. 
Titus Jasper A. Binjuan of Avila Village, North Point, Kevin Joseph Moralidad of Amaya Escapes, North Point. So, sino kaya sa kanila ang uh, mag-uuwi ng Best in QAQC Report? Gardening, gard gardening, 96.36%. Kevin Joseph Moralidad of Amaya Escapes North. po ng parang speechless po ako ngayon sa natanggap kong award. Pero <laughs> nagpapasalamat po ako kasi po na-recognize din po yung effort ko ng team po sa suporta ng team namin dito. Tsaka hindi po kami nag, ano, nagkakanya-kanya. Effort pa rin po kami ng suporta lang po. Tsaka always po nagre-remind sa isa't isa kapag may ano po sa aming magsasubmit sa report po. Yun lang po. Maraming salamat po. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. And for the President's POC report. The President's POC report is to determine the delay of the project per house unit or per scope of works. Yeah, ito din, to determine the issuance of notice of delay to ensure the projects comply in our top level quality objective. So, bakit ba may ganyang report? So, yun yung ating objective. That's why we have this President's POC report. So, sino kaya yung top three natin? Parang may North Point na naman dito. Kevin Joseph Moralidad, Jackie Luca Alin, and Christopher Jan Guasena. So, sino kaya sa kanila? For the best in President's POC report, Gathering 98.18% reports, so 2% na lang, 100% na siya. So we have Christopher John Gosena of Avida Village, North Point. North Point! Salamat po sa trust na binigay sa amin. Tsaka maraming salamat po sa team sa, ano, sa collaborating efforts po ng lahat ng uh, team dito sa Avida Village North Point. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Umahakot na ang North Point. Hahabol kaya ang ibang mga sites? Let's see for the next um, award for the turnover warranty monitoring report. So our top three for this So for the third over warranty, we have Annalisa Malibong, Shailene Salilin, and Flora May Sergado. So si North Point na naman, tuwa-tuwa na naman ng North Point. Pero mahabol ang Avida Village Iloilo. So third over warranty monitoring, ito yung monitoring natin for the turnover units kung nag-elaps na yung warranty nila. Okay. So, gathering 95% report submission efficiency for the best in turnover warranty monitoring report, we have Annalisa Malibong of North Point. <laughs> North Point, hindi na umuupo. Hello po sa lahat. Good afternoon. Um, thank you po sa, um, sa pag-recognize ng effort po namin dito. And same din po, um, team effort lang po always. At saka reminder po sa 
each of every, every one of us sa pag-submit ng mga reports weekly and monthly po. Thank you po, especially kay Sir Jophil and kay Ma'am Thank you. Thank you. Bigyan ng jacket. Bigyan ng jacket yan. So next is for the minutes of the meetings report. So syempre alam na alam naman natin minutes of the meeting is uh, ito yung sinasabi natin after every meeting. So who are who are top? Meron ba tayong top? Meron ba tayong na-nominate? Pali? Wala po. Unfortunately, wala. But, however, we will be giving a special award in minutes of the meeting report submission in recognition of the extraordinary efforts and dedication in submitting their report on time and of higher accuracy even on the earlier stage of the project. So, dun sa mga nag-start na, na, na pumasok ang 2021 na may project na wala at nakakuha nun. Pero, meron tayo na mga nagsimula pa lang na on the start of their project, nakakapagsabit na sila ng minutes of the So, gardening 85% report submission efficiency from September to November, we have Christine May Mierbo of Avida Village, Iloilo for the land development project. Um, yeah, so special award. So hindi na namin muna bibig uh hinihingan ng speech special award. Ah. So let's move to pero sana ang ang mangyayari niyan yung prize nyo yung prize na nakaalated for that particular award will be carry over to the next year award. So yan. For the next award CM QMS Daily Dashboard Report. So, ito naman yung sinasubmit every Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. Nandito yung update natin for the project, the BOC, the activity of the contractors, and also the efficiency of QAQC, and also the issues and concerns. So, for this one also, unfortunately, wala pa rin nakakuha ng award na ito. Kasi uh, usually may mga late or non-submission pa. So, sa inyo pa lang, alam nyo naman na yun na may pagkukulang tayo. So, again, the award for this is still black. So, next year, the cash prize for this will be carry over to the next year. For the project issues and the concerns report, Ito naman yung uh, monitoring of the issues and concerns ng project natin. So usually si admin ang nag-monitor nito or nagsasabot. So top three natin is Annalisa Malibo, Sherlyn Salini, Flora, Flora May Sertado. So ayan, higing na higil na naman si Tupi na, <laughs> na mabanggit ang North Point. So for the best in project issues and concerns report, gathering 97.73%. We have Annalisa Malibong of Amaya Escapes, no point. Let me go. Let me go. Hello po ulit. <laughs> Tinta mo. Thank you po ulit. <laughs> sa lahat. Wala na po ako may bibigay na speech. Kasi yun lang naman po. Yung mga... Thank you, Ana. Kung baga yung masasabi ko po sa lahat is yung on time na submission lang po palagi. Dapat isecure lang po natin yung submission na early. On time. Tapos yung... Ano ba? Suporta ng team. Yan po. At saka thank you po ulit, Sir Jophil. Alright. So next is last for the individual. 
report award is the monthly disuod report. So, ito naman sinasubmit natin to disuod. Top 3 are Kenneth Mark Benzer of Amaya Escapes in Ilo, Joseph Torres of Amaya Escapes North Point, and Carlo Angelo Carlo. <laughs> That's top three pa lang, no? Top three pa lang. Hindi pa nananalo. So, for the best in monthly disood report, guiding 100%. So, yung sabihin, lagi siyang on time. Lagi siyang nagsasabi. So, we have Joseph Torres of Amaya Space. <laughs> Uh, thank you po ulit sa, ano, sa trust and then sa award po na to. Uh, uh, ko, ano ko lang po sa recommend ko lang po sa, dun, sa mga nagmagawa din po ng report. Ano lang. Uh, prior to report dapat nag-gather na po tayo ng data para may send po natin noong time. Yun lang po. And then, salamat po sa team ko ulit sa support. Thank you, Sir Joseph and Team North Point. Advice So, ayan. So, for the individual reports award, tapos na tayo. So, but I remind, remind lang namin kayo na each award, makaka-receive kayo ng certificate and 500 pesos cash prize. So, si Lord Toy, umaagwas na. So, let's see for the best employee. Let's start for the best safety officer. Criteria are 25% timely submission of reports, 25% proper implementation of safety practices, 25% issue close out efficiency, and 25% of the head office assessment. So who are our top three? We have Titus Jasper Binuan of Abida Village North Point, Carlo Angelo Carion of Binuan, Jose Marie Cercado of Avida Village, Iloilo. Sino kaya ang best safety officer natin for year 2021? Mag-ingay ang mga nominees. And our best safety officer, gardening 95.53%, 95.53% in overall performance evaluation from January to November 2021, we have Carlo Angelo Carlo. Policies, 
proper documentation on site, head office assessment, all 25%. Sino ba yung mga nag-top three natin sa mga admins natin? We have Annalisa Malibong, babaan natin, Maya Sherlyn Saliri, Laura May Sertado, sila pa din, di ba? So, kung makikita nyo, sa timely submission of reports, papasok na agad kayo dyan. So, magkatalo na lang tayo sa pagkabaitunan nyo ng mga HR rules and regulations sa sites and also the proper documentation. Ready na ba kayo for the best admin award? Garnering 84.66% in overall performance evaluation. The best admin 2021 is Maria Sherlyn Saligi of Avida Village, North Point. Dancing Mama ng North Point. Um, hi po sa lahat. Uh, thank you po sa pag-recognize sa uh, amin dito sa North Point. We are so overwhelmed. <laughs> Nang yung masasabi ko lang po, uh, team effort po talaga yung best na gawin sa project site para po lahat ng mga reports, lahat po ng mga ng kailangan gawin ay makuha po at mapasa ng maayos. Yun lang po. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Charlene, and to Team North Point. By the way, our best employees will receive their certificate and 1,000 pesos each. Ready for the best wow. project? Ito na. Ay, sorry. Meron pa palang dalawa. Next site ako dun sa admin. Wala ko wala pa. So, meron pa pala tayong best project in charge and also best manager. So, sa mga project in charge naman, 35% of team members rating, 30% KPI evaluation, and 35% of head office assessment. So, who are, who are our top three? Napapagod na akong sabihin ng Christopher John Goseno of Abida Village North Point, Audrey Marie Adra of Abida Village Iloilo, and Jojo Rebancos of Amaya Sky Show. Ayan, may nakita na kami bagong buka. For the project in charge, best. Gardening 84.66%. Our best in charge, Masyado masaya ang North Point. Audrey Marie Adra of Abido Village, Iloilo. Nawala na sila. Nawala na sila. Abby. Abby. Audrey. Peach. Cheers! Audrey po. Speech na. Speech po. Speech. Ah, okay. Thank you, Mantine, and most especially to Sir Joffail and the Just Team. Uh, ang award na to ay binabahagi ko rin sa mga ka-team ko dahil kung hindi rin sa kanila, hindi ko rin ma-achieve yung pagiging best project in charge. And yun lang po, yung maibibigay rin namin na payo as well as katulad kina Sir Joseph na dapat uh, laging on time and time management yung pag-ano ng mga untoggle, mga reports, and as well as sa mga system and procedures, dapat sinusunod din natin yung mga kailangan nating sundin. So, yun lang po. And congratulations sa lahat rin po na nakakuha ng mga awards. Pa-shout out to po si Sir. That's great. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So, for the best manager naman, 35% of team members rating, 30% of KPI evaluation, and 35% head office assessment. Our top three, Arman Manlapat, <gasps> Kenneth Mark Spencer of Amaya Skates, Iloilo, 
Joseph Torres of Amaya Escapes North Point. Ayan. So, kung may pwesto na si Audrey, papalakpak na yata para kay Kenneth Mark Spencer. Pero, ang ating best manager, gardening 92.82%, Joseph Torres of North Point. Gim, sigla mo na may pagpalakpak. Uh, thank you po sa pag <laughs> pagano po ng, ano, ng effort namin ng team sa ano and then pag-recognize po ng effort namin saka sa support po ng team ko na dahil kung hindi dahil sa kanya sa kanila hindi rin namin makakamit kung ano nato hindi ko rin makukuha itong award na ito thank you po thank you Thank you, Sir Joseph Torres. So, that's for our best employees. So, sana yung mga iba natin na hindi na kamit ang award na ito next year. Sana kayo naman ang marinig namin. So, for the best project overall, ito na is um, criteria na nito is yung total close out ninyo versus the total number of issues. So for the QEQC effectiveness, our top four are Abida Village in Lilo, Amaya Escapes North Point, Abida Village North Point, and Amaya Escapes Iloilo. Actually, this top four. Kasi si Amaya Escapes Iloilo 100%. Ayan. So, yung top four na yan, actually, they are 100% efficiency when it comes to close out ng mga QAQC issues. Pero, nagkatali lang tayo ngayon sa number o sa dami ng mga quality issues na nakikita nila sa side nila. So, ibig sabihin, they are effective sa pagtingin sa mga um, sa mga housing units or sa project na naka-assign sa kanila. So, they have actually 1,160 issues. 1,160 issues from January to November 2021. So, meaning, they have 100 for at least per, per month. Ayan, so dami nilang nagiging uh, nai-inspect or nakikita ng mali na kailangan itama. So for the best project in overall QAQC effectiveness is Amaya Escapes North Point. Magsaya! Some advice na lang, Sir Joseph. Paano ba kayo paano ba kayo nag-inspect? Paano nyo ba tinitignan yung mga bahay? You have the same eyes. On behalf of on my team or on our team rather nang maraming salamat po sa award na nareceive namin na achieve po namin ang award na ito for the effort ng team tsaka sa effort din po ng contractor sa pagpapalo up ng mga ano namin mga issues namin tsaka sa, sa kanilang mabilis na pag-rectify po maraming salamat po Yun. thank you so much Kevin so next best project ayan so papakita natin yung mga scores nila. So, yeah, sabi ko nga sa inyo, 100% po kayo ng close down. Pero, yung issues raised ninyo ay ganyan karae. So, yung mga escapes ilo-ilo, sila naman yung second with 556 issues raised. Okay? So, next is overall issues and concerns close out. Total number of close out issues versus the total number of issues. So, sino ba yung mga effective when it comes to close out ng issues and concerns? Ang top four natin are 
Amaya Scapes to ba na tuan? Amaya Sky Show. Avida Southfield Settings to Bali. And Amaya Scapes North Point. So sila yung apat na top natin for the close out of issues and concerns. The best project in overall issues and concerns close out 100% close out sila from January to November 2021. R, 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 North Point, and Amaya Sky Show. Okay, North Point, so bayan na natin kay Amaya Sky Show yung speech, ha? Speech Sir Jojo, Nicole, Noel. Screenshots. Hindi, hindi dyan tayo na-open yan. Hindi, wala na. Uh, good afternoon. In behalf of Amaya Sky Show team, uh, thank you for this award. Uh, hindi namin ina-expect, pero masaya kami at na-appreciate yung ano namin. Ginagawa. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, show team. Yan, pakita din natin ulit. 100% sila. Si Cabana 2 is 93.0%. Konti na lang, konting push pa. Push pa natin yan, mga ibang uh, team. So, for the best project in Zero Punch Mike is... Mike Sir? Yes, sir. Okay, so best project in zero punch list at first inspection, that is total number of zero punch list at first inspection over total number of third over units. So, sino ba yung magaling mag third over sa inyo or hindi nyo hinahayaan na si CM, uh, si CRU or si QMU ang uh, makapag punch list niyan. So top two natin are Amaya Escapes to ba natuan? And Amaya Escapes North Point. So silang dalawa. So sino kaya, sino kaya sa kanilang dalawa ang nakakuha ng best project in zero punch list at first inspection? Sino kaya sa kanilang dalawa? Can I hear Amaya Escapes to ba natuan? Papatalo ba ang Amaya Escapes North Point? Oh, ata. Papatalo ata. Papatalo ba ang North Point? Sa kamay escapes ka ba na tuan? Papatalo ata. Wala na. What? <laughs> delay. Delay. Delay lang. So sige na nga. Wala na nang talo. Kayo na nga dalawa yon. Best project in zero punch list at first in the 100% zero punch list. Yung may escapes ka ba na tuan? 79 minutes. Si North Point is 100%. Okay. So North Point, pwede bang ipaubayan na rin natin ang speech sa kabanatuan? Amaya Skims kabanatuan? Okay, Paul, Miss Lynn. para ma-hit namin yung zero punch list every time na nag-inspect si CR. Ayun. Thank you po for this award po. Thank you. Nice ka ba na to us? Next tayo is for the best project in schedule, zero delay. So ito yung may mga project 
na zero delay sila. So that's that's based on the monthly KPI average rating in terms of schedule zero delay or our uh, functional level quality of checklists. Stop three natin is a Maya Steps North Point, Avida Village North Point, and Avida Village Iloilo. Ang ating best project in zero delay attaining 129% average actual POC is Avida Village Iloilo. <laughs> Ayan, o this, pitch po. Short lang. Asa na sige? Tayo, sige. So next tayo is most economical projects. So, ito yung nakaka-attain ng 40% uh, or more than na savings nila sa kanilang credit cash. So, ito yung mga less expense. Yung mga hindi masyadong magastos na mga sites natin. Ang ating um, ang ating result is validated of our uh, uh, ng ating accounting officer. So, top 3 natin is si Amaya Scalcio. Avida Village Iloilo and Avida Village Amaya Escapes North Point. So our most economical project attaining 126.24% average savings. So napakatitid naman nila. So ayan na, naka-flash na sa screen. Amaya Escapes North Point. Ayan. Ana, paano ka ba nakakabudget? Ana, paano mo binabudget? Paano? Paano mo binabudget? No. Hello po. Um, thank you po sa award ng Most Economical Project. For so, sa amin po dito, um, yung ginagawa po namin is pag may mga malalaking expenses po, hindi po namin kinukuha sa petty cash. Yung ginagawa po namin is nag-BBR po talaga kami para hindi po namin ma, ma, magagalaw yung, ano namin, yung cash on hand po. And then, ang, ano rin po, kasi wala din po kami konti lang yung expenses namin dito. So siguro isa na rin yun sa point na nakadagdag para po manalo ka po kami. So thank you po. Thank you, Anna. So let's, ayan, uh, makikita natin kung ilan percent. Actually, 100 percent. So mga excellent naman tayo. Yung top three natin. Meron lang talaga umukos ng paunti. So for our best project in EHS, ito H O Validated to. Evaluated pala. So, top three natin are Amaya Escape CDO, Avida Village North Point, and Avida Village Iloilo. So, best project in EHS natin, tayong-tayo na ang North Point, gardening of 95.5% is Avida Village Iloilo. Congrats! 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 Congrats!
So, maraming salamat at sa sunod ipagpatuloy pa rin namin yung mga ginagawa namin dito. That's all. Thank you and Merry Christmas, Happy New Year and Advance. Happy Holidays to you and to your team. So next method is the best project in monthly book reports. So ito is uh, criteria niya is tiny submission and deducted lang tayo ng 1% in overall score. So it's monthly report is a team effort. Hindi to pang isahang tao lang. Hindi lang si admin ito. So lahat lang at kayo dito nag-collaborate to uh, for the body book reports top top 3 unfortunately wala tayo na top na top or wala pumasok sa best in monthly book reports kasi most of our teams or project meron silang laptop na hindi sila nakapag-submit or late na sila nakapag-submit pero pero we have a special award in monthly book reports. This is in recognition of their great efforts and dedication. So, garnering 80% report submission efficiency, we have a My Sky Show. Ayan, sila lagi yung nakakapagpasa ng monthly book reports as well as uploaded na siya. Any words from Nicole? Hi ma'am. Thank you po sa pag-appreciate nung sa paggawa ng book report. <laughs> Hindi po magagawa yun kung walang team effort kasama ni Sir Joe Chan ni Sir Robert. Thank you ma'am. Thank you Sir Joe. Thank you. Thank you. Ang laki ng naitulong ng mga taga-butas mo Nicole. Butas na butas na Nicole. <laughs> Okay, so next natin is best project in paper report. It is not individual, so it's a big effort then. Our top three are Amaya Escapes or Daneta, Avida Village Iloilo, Avida Village North Point. So our best project in paper is Avida Village North Point. I'm sorry. Atama, Abida Village North Point, and Amaya Escapes or Daneta. So, dalawa sila. Hello po, hello po ulit. Thank you po ulit sa pag-appreciate ng trabaho namin. Yung ano lang namin is... Kailangan po natin gawin yung beeper every month, uh, every 27, and um, sabi tayo on time. And wag po tayong mag, ano, uh, sabihin natin yung totoo po sa beeper kung nagpapat tayo sa sub po. Nilagay po natin, wag po tayong matapat para makita na natin ang katuhanan po. Thank you! Okay, thank you for our best in paper report. For our best project in risk and opportunity register, ito yung timing na nasasubmit for 30 ng RO register natin. And isa lang siya. Nag-iisa lang siya na nakakompleto nung tatlong quarter natin for this year. So that is Avida Southfield Settings to Bali for the best project in RO Register Report. Nasa ng New Bali. Oh, sige, parang ayaw nilang mag-speech. Let's move to our best project in KPI progress report. For the best project in KPI progress report, 
our criteria is the overall percentage of completion, the zero punch list, and ito yung mga ano, uh, item natin on our CPI. Ang nadagdag lang is the tiny submission of report, which is dapat on the 27th of the month, na isasamig yun na yung inyong accomplishment for your KPI. So our top three for the KPI are Amaya Escape North Point, Abida Village to Ilo, and Amaya Sky Show. So sila yung mga uh, nakakapag-submit on time, sila din yung uh, mataas yung mga KPI ratings nila. So, sino ba ang best project natin in KPI progress report? Gathering 97.47% in overall KPI evaluation is Amaya Escapes North Point. Nagulat na naman si Miss Anna Lisa. <laughs> Hindi makapaniwala. Salamat po ulit sa ano, ano man? sa pag-recognize po ng effort namin and sa help po ng team namin <laughs> na, <laughs> at saka yung mga team members ko na nakikipag ko, na nakikipag ko pero ipag uh, uh, nangihingi na ako ng update. Salamat po ulit and yun po. Thank you, Sir Joseph. Let's move to our best project in internal audit. So, ito yung mga projects na um, less ang OFIs or NCs nila versus dun sa number of items in our audit checklist. So, so sino-sino ba yan? Ang top two natin are Amaya Escapes North Point and Amaya Escapes Cabanatuan. So sila yung um, konti lang yung OFI nila during our second internal audit last July 5 to 9. So sino kaya yung may less na OFIs? So wala naman silang NC. So OFIs lang ito. Having only 4 OFIs out of the 53 items on our checklist, during the internal audit conducted last July 5 to 10, our best project in internal audit is Amaya Escapes Cabanatuan. And we have a short speech from Cabanatuan, from Amaya Escapes Cabanatuan. <laughs> Best project yes. in internal audit. Hi. Ayan po, uh, collaborative partner po ng TPI. Uh, and, ano, pangyayari uh, uh, lang po yan. Uh, 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 familiar tayo sa PFI. Uh, uh, Ms. Manuel. So, ito naman lahat. Uh, Tatapat ko lang po sa mga first time in Pagiging uh, ba kaunti yung NC o halos wala po. So the team, uh, salamat kasi uh, uh, very cooperative sila and uh, dedicated na kasi sa saan ang tips natin to how to, uh, how to become uh, efficient dun sa MS uh, or yun lang po. Thank you. Thank you, Sir Arman. Okay, so kung may best, internal, best in internal audit tayo, meron tayong most compliant project. Ito yung mabilis na nakapag-close out ng OFI or NC nila during our internal audit. So our top two for most compliant project are Abida Village North Point and the Maya Escapes North Point. So lalayo pa ba tayo sa North Point? Ang ating most compliant project is Abida Village North Point. Taining 96.2. <laughs> Hello po ulit. Um, thank you po ulit sa, no, sa, sa award and um, uh, thank you ulit po. This award is dedicated to aking team po para sa uh, tulong-tulong po kami mag-close out po ng report, ay, ng, ano, ng uh, uh, audit report para mag-close out agad po. Thank you. <laughs> 
right? So, it's still it's a team col collaboration. For the, la uh, for the last, for our uh, project, our best in customer satisfaction survey, ito yung naging results natin noong January to June 2021 na CSS natin. So, our... Um, that's uh, the result. So, makikita nyo na dyan kung sino. So, our uh, best in customer satisfaction survey are Avida Operations Team. This is the Avida IA rectification team. And Amaya Skips Kabanatuan. That is both na, uh, pina, minamanage ni Sir Arman Manlava. Yeah. So, si Amaya Skips is 3.8. Si operations natin si Abita is for ang rating nila. So Sir Arman, paano kaya natin to paano kaya tayo nagkaroon ng mataas na rating for our CSS? Ano lang po? Ah, uh, based on sa experience po namin sa mga kanina ito. And kabanat po, kabanat po. Ano lang po? Ah, uh, yung ah, uh, customer requirement, uh, kailangan lang po natin i-meet. Ngayon, kung hindi naman kaya, uh, let, let them know kung kailan kaya. Kasi mag-expect sila eh. Parang ganun yung siguro sa tingin ko. Uh, Nabibiliver namin. Ay, kasabihin, ay hindi, kailangan namin yan. Uh, ng ganito. Kung hindi naman talaga kaya, sinasabi namin. Willing naman mag-adjust yung client as long as alam din naman din yung naman yung yung talagang ginagawa sa site. So, in lang. Uh, constant communication lang. Communicate kung kaya, communicate kung hindi kaya. Para ma-adjust, uh, recommit, uh, para mahit yung talagang commitment na gusto ng client o ng uh, CMG natin. Yun lang po, yung sa experience ko na baka sa kalit na makatulong din po sa inyo. Thank you. Thank you so much, Arman, for that wonderful advice. So, this is our overall project efficiency award. So, this is overall na sa lahat na to ng aspect of your project. Ito ay kinuha namin from your TTI progress report, the timely submission of your weekly and monthly reports. So, deducted lang tayo ng 1% if ever there are um incompleteness of the content from the improper documentation or may mga kulang tayo sa report. So our top three for over, overall project efficiency are Amaya Skips North Point, Avida Village North Point, and Avida Village Iloilo. So silang tatlo ang ating nominees for the overall project efficiency. So siguro may clue na kayo kung sino sa kanila. This overall project efficiency will receive the certificate and 1,000 pesos for your team. So our overall project efficiency attaining an average of 91.41%, very satisfactory in overall KPI evaluation is Amaya Escapes North Point. Diyan na rin po. Salamat po sa ano sa pag-recognize ulit ng effort namin. It's not just me, it's my team. It's not you, it's me. Ganun po ba 'yon, sir? Sir Joseph. Okay. Yeah, so yay! Thank you so much sa mga projects natin. Hopefully, next year kayo naman yung makita namin na ipa-flash sa screen for the nominated na mga projects. So last for our uh, award will be our service awardee. So our five-year service awardee 2021 will receive a plaque, plaque of appreciation and uh, a thank you plaque 
our five year service awardee for this year are sila yung mga five years na sa atin na uh, doing their best efforts para sa ating lahat. So we have Ken Tyler Tabios from the Pasquale office. We have, punta kayo dito sa harap, Arman Manlapat. So we see your flag. Carlo Angelo. Carlo Angelo. Hello, Karyon. And we have also Sir Elmer Atanasio to give the speech. Ayan. Sir Elmer. Si Sir Elmer muna ang mag... Nasa'y plak. Nasa'y plak. Nasa'y plak. Hello, ma'am. Yes, sir. Speech ka na po. Ay, ako ba? Yes, ma'am. Well, mabilis naman pala ng panahon. Kalahating dekada na pala ako sa jazz. Anyway, maraming maraming salamat sa jazz, sa ating mentor, sa CEO, kay Boss Jopin. Ganon din kayo, ma'am Tang. Salamat sa mga words of encouragement, guidance, and advice. Once again, thank you for everything. Salamat pa, uh, Boss Jopin. Sir Elmer, papadala na lang po namin ang inyong plan. Yes po. Thank you. Thank you. Ayan. Thank you so much. So that's the end of our Project Awards and Service Awardee. So ready na ba kayo for our bingo? Bingo na ba? Bingo? Bingo na. Bingo na. So sige. So for our bingo, sa yung mga winning pattern natin, sinento na sa mga admins natin. 